neighborhood church buildings more than a century old, but look at conditions here now. High grass, weeds inside, they say flood damage. There's a church conference that wants this torn down, replaced with a shopping area. But there are people in the neighborhood who feel this building should be saved. In a 21st century Pittsburgh, tear down culture and policies and incentives that promote it must end. The nearly 110 year old Albright United Methodist Church would be demolished in a sale by the denomination's Western Pennsylvania Conference. The would be developer would tear it down for a commercial development that would include a drive through Starbucks. The more we take away those buildings, the more we eliminate them, we eliminate the history and the story of actually what is great about this city. We can stop and we can think about it before we bring in the wrecking ball. After this public outpouring, Pittsburgh's Planning Commission just voted to join the Historic Review Commission in recommending the church be designated historic. That could keep it from being torn down, but it doesn't force anyone to fix it up. I think it's very likely that my client will say we need to assert our private property rights and return to court. The water and electricity has been off, the steps are in disrepair, the grass is knee high. This is where they say they hold religious services. All I can say is I'm very upset about this. The tremendous community support for not only seeing Albright remain in the community as a historic building, but the potential opportunity for how the building can serve all members of the community going forward. Pittsburgh City Council would have the final say and vote on any historic designation. At the Albright Church Building on Center Avenue, Bob Mayo, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.